It might have been a little more than a month's delay, but former minister and Olympic medalist Wendell Motley was presented with this country's highest award, the Order of the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago, today. He received the award for his distinguished service to the nation and contribution to public service at President's House. Mr. Motley used the opportunity to urge the younger generation to find a mentor. Marie Hull reports. It brings back memories. It's, 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 it's as heavy as my Olympic and Commonwealth Games medals. 37 days later, but that hasn't stopped Wendell Adrian Motley from being recognized for his sterling contribution to Trinidad and Tobago. At age 77, the former government minister and Olympic medalist said he was thankful to receive the ORTT. I am deeply honored, sincerely. You can't imagine. The fact is, I am a nationalist, and I can think of no better reward for the service that I gave to Trinidad and Tobago willingly because I'm deeply committed to this country. But he didn't do it alone, recalling some mentors who helped shape his career. From QRC days, Boy Scouts, with mentors like Mervyn McCorney and Terry Ennis in the Scout movement, early days, track and field at QRC, guys like Leroy Williams and the sports masters, Grell and Springer, and then on to Yale, my old Polish Catholic coach, Bob Gingak. And he urged young people to try to do the same. Many thoughts go through your mind. Some are weak and banal, but always in every one of us, I'm convinced, there is something powerful that is guiding us. Don't listen to the weak and banal. Listen to that guiding angel and then seek mentorship. I can't stress that more strongly. There are people out there, if you show a little spark, an initiative will seek to help you along. A total of 50 people received national yeah, awards award this year. Marie Hall, TTT News. Thank you. Former government minister and economist Wendell Motley says a decision on whether to devalue the TNT dollar further at this time would require consultation. He was cautious as he responded to questions from reporters on the topic. It was in 1993, while as Minister of Finance, Mr. Motley took the bold decision to float the TNT dollar and relax the foreign exchange controls. I spearheaded it, but it was a collective decision. This time, let other people make those decisions and let them bear that collective uh, reflection.